A-I-T-A. Am I the a-hole for yelling at my vegan sister for throwing out a bunch of food I paid for? My sister became vegan at around age 13 and has made it her entire lifestyle. At first, me and my parents thought it was good that she wanted to help animals get better treatment, but in the past few months, she has gotten a lot more radical. She recently went through the pantry and fridge, and threw out all the meat products. She went on a loud rant inside a McDonald's about how evil McDonald's is. She berated my dad for bringing home a steak to cook for himself until he threw it in the garbage. My mom still wants to support her, but I can see she is getting tired of dealing with my sister. Now on to the actual event. I was coming home and I decided to pick up some Burger King on the way back. I ordered about $25 worth of food for me and my dad, and I used my own money from working around the neighborhood. I returned home and, stupidly, put it in the fridge because my dad hadn't gotten home yet. My sister comes into the kitchen and says that she is going to make herself a salad. I say, okay, but please don't throw away the Burger King in the fridge, me and dad are going to eat it later. She says fine and I run upstairs to use the bathroom. I don't really think much of it because she wouldn't throw away my food, right? Wrong. I get down after and open the fridge to see it is not there. I put two and two together, and run to the trash to see all the burgers thrown in there. I run to the dining room to see my sister drinking my coke and my fries along with her salad. I tell her that she owes me $25 now, and she smugly says, you also owe animals some respect. Then I just frocking lost it. I yelled at her for a good 15 minutes about how everyone is sick and tired of her bullshit, and that she has no right to decide what others do with their food. She was so shocked that she just went to her room, and I heard her crying when I went to bed later that night. Both of my parents are calling me the a-hole, but I frankly have put up with this for long enough, and don't want more good food thrown out like that. I probably shouldn't have yelled at her for as long as I did, and I probably should have apologized by now, but I just don't know. What do you guys think? A-I-T-A? Am I the a-hole? N-T-A. Your sister is exactly the reason that vegans get a bad rap. She is 100% the a-hole and she owes you $25. N-T-A. She's an a-hole for throwing out your food that you paid for and a double a-hole for eating some of it. What point was she actually making here? The cows had already given their meat and milk to make whatever burgers she threw away. Isn't that more disrespectful to the animal's sacrifice than actually eating them? So now the animals died for no reason? Yes, I understand a cow makes more than one burger, I'm being as hyperbolic as the sister here. NTA. Not the a-hole. Your parents should back you up here. Your sister acted like an absolute a-hole. She throws your food away then eats part of it that she likes. And you paid for it all. What an odd. NTA. Dude she was completely out of line. My sister is vegan and even when she was in her most hardcore phase, she never would have thrown out anyone's food but my parents also wouldn't have tolerated that nonsense. It's one thing to listen to someone preaching, it's a whole other to let them bully you into throwing out your own steak. And the fact that she started eating your fries and drinking your coke, I mean talk about adding insult to injury. She deserved to be yelled at and should absolutely pay you back for that food. Also she's not saving any animals by throwing out burgers and steaks, the cows were already dead. She's just contributing to more waste. You should start throwing away her food, and if your parents say anything tell them this is the precedent they said apparently it's okay to throw food in the garbage that you don't like, right? NTA. Eat your sister as a form of dominance. NTA. She not only threw away your burgers, but she also ate your chips and drank your coke. This was clearly not about helping the animals, it was about being smug and forcing things to go her way. 
I understand how vegans get passionate about things because they have educated themselves on animal cruelty in the meat and dairy industry, and it upsets them that other people won't do it. But throwing away other people's food is not how to get them on your side. And eating other people's food has nothing to do with being vegan, and everything to do with being a brat. NTA. Not the a-hole. She's being the kind of vegan that makes people have a knee-jerk reaction to the vegans who are respectful of other people's dining wishes and needs. The fact she throws out food that's neither hers or for her is incredibly disrespectful of other people's property, regardless of if it's food or not. She also needs to be aware of some things. There are people who literally cannot live on a diet of plant alone, due to assorted medical conditions and allergies. Everybody living a 100% vegan diet is also not sustainable in the long run, as it costs far more in resources for her salad than it does your burger, because you can fit a few hundred heads of cattle on less land than it would take to grow enough grains and leaves to feed even a small neighborhood for a couple months. There's also the factor of not all land is the same and some places are far more suited to livestock than produce because it's not fertile soil. She is absolutely the a-hole and yes, she owes you the $25 for the Burger King, and frankly owes your parents for the wasted food from her kitchen purge. Supporting her is one thing, letting her, a child, dictate the diets of the entire household to the point of disrespect and outright theft is another. NTA. Also if she ate Burger King fries. She isn't a real vegan. Just out of curiosity why? They are prepared in a non-vegan fryer. Plus they have palm oil which can be terrible for the environment. As a vegan myself, I have to say NTA. She has no right to throw your food away and frankly, I'd rather someone actually got a meal out of the animals dying rather than it all just ending up in the garbage. Maybe tell her that. It's so much worse for the animals and the climate slash pollution what she did there. She can't force you to be vegan. That being said, of course it's always something to think about. Side note, Burger King from the fridge sounds really gross but you do you haha. NTA at all. She's behaving like an absolute rocket. She can eat what she wants to. She can't dictate what others eat. She also owes you money for the food she threw away. NTA. What the frock? Your parents are pushovers. Why would they even let her go off scot-free after the first time she threw y'all's food away? Jesus. Your sister is an entitled ass and the reason people don't like vegans. Your parents need to grow up and, well, parent. NTA. You just yelled at her. I'd take fries and coke then her salad and throw it all into garbage as well. NTA. And your parents are part of the problem if they haven't insisted that she pay for the food she has thrown out. Once she gets the message that when she throws meat out, more meat will be purchased using her money, thereby doubling the quantity of meat consumed, I hope that she'll recognize that it's better to control her own actions and stop trying to control yours. BTW. The business of her eating your fries and drinking your soda really pushes this over the top. That's not some sort of outraged moral crusade, that's a greedy person eating other people's food because she feels like it. While you could have probably handled it better, the fact that you don't have an infinite amount of patience, and lost it after she has been consistently acting like shoot does not make you an a-hole. Your sister is an absolute a-hole for what she did with your food and all the other stuff too. She gets absolutely no say in anyone's dietary choices, except from her own and she needs to learn some respect and boundaries. NTA in the slightest. It's great that she wants to support better treatment of animals, as you said. However, it doesn't sound like that's actually what she cares about. It sounds to me like she's found an avenue to subject you and your family to her moral busybodying, and doesn't actually care about animals at all. Do not give her an inch on it unless she can conduct herself in a civilized manner. NTA. 
Reading this pisses me off so much. Who the hell does she think she is throwing away other people's food? She has no right to throw away or even touch things that aren't hers. Also, from a principal point of view, the animal has already died, was already cooked, and purchased. Preventing you from eating it serves no purpose towards bettering the lives of animals. Her behavior likely does more to promote the mistreatment of animals as it turns far more people off from veganism than it converts.